to even celebrate flooded last year. Now we are working with WRD to get a plan done for the entire Miramar area. And the problem is that DB road is only one road that is motorable properly. And if I break that road to clear the thing, mm. people will be even more pissed off. So now we have to work, we have to check and see when the best time is to do it also now. If we break the Miramar circle, that is the main thoroughfare now. You right spoke now, also right national data. So what is the current position about that? See, we had five commissioners between the two. Is it, is it coming back to CCP or what is it? No, no, the property will come back to us. Anyhow. Then, then what are you planning to do? So then we see right now we have to look at the financial interests of the corporation also. Oh. See in 2016, the, then uh, the council had raised uh, taxes, but it was not notified. Now a lot of now the CCP currently is running into a three crore loss per month because people are not paying the house tax because of a high court order. See now back then procedure was not following. Now we are bearing the brunt of it. No, so now this is the only way we can get out of it. So what are you planning to do? See, now there is, it's an high court, there is nothing we can do. sell it or to no, no, do no. something See, we what? are not selling it. We want to basically develop the thing and lease it out. Develop in sense like what? Pay commercial, pay commercial. Pay parking, <coughs> commercial, commercial, commercial. Shops. See, yeah. See, revenue has to come into the property, into the corporation. That is our main thing. If we can cover, like I said now, if we can cover our uh, monthly salary expenses, now the corporation should be a very good thing. That means we have crores of rupees to spend every month on development itself. Right now, most of our money is going towards paying off uh, salaries, no, which is not sustainable in the long run. One of your former mayor, Uday Malhekar, has questioned about Smart City Works and said there needs to be auditing done on this. What again, all of those it? issues you take up with the Smart City MD also. No? Wherever we can, we've been... Uh, you know, Mangrove walkway, which is from See, a lot of these projects have not been given us, uh, we've not taken proper handover also. See, none of the Smart City projects have given us official handover. Our promenade also is not completed, so we've not taken it. See, now the burden of cleaning still falls upon us also. No? The problem is everyone associates uh, the cooperation with Smart City work, which is not true. Smart City is not undertaken a single project. But we have to work with the contractors to make sure that nothing happens and the people don't suffer. Then it's Greek Kajiga after the update. That is the WRT. There is there's some uh, small work that is still left. That is why there is an uh, issue. That they will get done. So, what's the update on the National Theatre building? We have put, uh, we have filed for eviction. Now oh, they've approached, they've approached High Court. No? We filed for eviction, so now we are waiting to see what uh, happens. Hopefully within this year we will resolve all those issues. Actually. Yeah. Thank you. Here once again as a mayor. Thank you. Now, next for the next one year, so what would be your priorities again now? See now we uh, we want to continue with all the work that we started on initially. Now for example also our CCP building had taken some time, but now you've seen they started the leveling work. Now, that also has not been done for the past 15 years. So we want to resolve the entire. Uh, Prasa the commerce area and we want to put up a new corporation building. Now projects like this will go a long way towards stabilizing the corporation's uh, finances also. Father, please. See, our plan now for the corporation is to be totally self-sufficient. You know, we want to, I eventually want to reach a point where I want to lower taxes for the whole city. But to do that now, I need to take control of all the properties that we have currently also. And all our properties have been in some sort of litigation the other. So now we are making good progress when it comes to settling all of these issues. We are working on the market, uh, third phase of the market, we want to get that resolved. And we want to do a national theatre, we also fight for uh, eviction and then move to Icon. So we want to resolve all of those issues. In the meantime, we want to start, uh, we will actually want to progress on everything else. So last year also, when you had taken over charges, the mayor, you had uh, spoken about these properties and all. So in the next, uh, last one year, uh, have you all found that uh, at least you all be able to get those properties back or what it is? See, no, what, issue. see what we have realized also now over the past one year is more How many of these properties are? See now our main focus is one, no, is our national data building, is our market uh, phase 3 and our CCP building. Now the, if we get those properties and if we develop those properties, the revenue come to the corporation will be in crores. So now see once I cover my cost for labor, no, uh -huh. then that means that it's a, uh, CCP will be in a very good financial position. We will never in, uh, ever have to increase taxes on the people again. So yeah. now what has happened to the market issue then? Because time and again that has, you have been taking up the decision. So has it reached to a point where you can get to the See, I'll be very honest also. The only time, now see if you look at any of the procedures, no, none of the procedures were followed up till now. Even to get a state officer appointed to even hear the cases was done now, during this tenure. Okay. It was not done prior. Even all the opposition people made a noise, no, saying why don't you have hearings. When it came to anything, when it came to settlements or whatever it was, they said, you all, uh, you know, why do you want to do it? No, you do it in-house. In-house, what you realize is uh, none of the procedures have been followed at all. No hearings had been done properly, no estate offer had been done properly. The cases were left at a rot only. Because now nobody wanted to take that uh, political decision, nobody wanted to take uh, the heat when it comes to all of that. So that's why none of the files moved. 
Now slowly we've been putting everything into place and hopefully now within this next year now we can get everything resolved. So can we expect all these things clear, get cleared in this year? Yeah, hopefully. See, now our CCP building has already started. We've already passed eviction orders on everybody in this building. Once we get this building, we are tearing down now as and we will have that. So as and now, we want to, see, we want to reach all the decisions amicably. We are not in. We are not interested in throwing anybody out of their properties or whatever it is, especially in this uh, in this building. We have parents who have been here for the past 25, uh, 30 years. So we want to settle with them amicably, and we want a new CC building because we will benefit. The population will benefit, and they will benefit also by getting uh, new shops and everything. So, so another, we want to. Another issue is this smart city works. It must have been a headache for you, though everybody says development is needed. Yeah. But the way things have been going on in the past few months, and now still yet not completed. See now 31st, they are saying the deadline is the 31st of May. You think it will be completed by 31st May? Oh, I am hoping that it will get done by Hoping? Then. But looking you at the situation? Everyone, see, everyone has given us assurances. I can only go by those assurances. So 31st May is what they have committed and all of them have been rushing to get all the projects done as well also. Which is why now they have been closing. Even the, we waived the, what's it called, the pay parking charges now because of the speed of uh, the work that is going on also now. So they plan on closing, they were planning on closing more roads. So now it will become a total inconvenience to all the people also, so we had to waive the pay parking. So like that, we are hoping issue by issue everything gets uh, resolved. See, once this development work is done, no, then Panjim will be in a much better position. You know, all this work is required. How would you be getting? No, see, now the contractors, if they have not also been following, I think it is correct. If people filed a thing, it is good also. The contractors also should uh, learn a lesson. That they also are causing a lot of inconvenience to the people. I mean, we have been out there addressing the issues of the people now since uh, day one also. Now it's good. I welcome this uh, thing. No, but how would you address all these issues during the rainy season? Because now things would. Uh, the deadline is 31st May. After that, sooner rains will start. That so time you will see the correct scenario of so That is what I'm saying also. That's why we've been going out and doing inspections also now with everything also now. So even now the works that some of the contractors have done, they have sealed some of our drains. Now we have asked them. Now this is, I think this is the first time also that they've opened up these drains after 20 years also now. There's huge Portuguese drains that we have now. We are getting those done throughout the yeah, last year also, see even, I just want to remind you all, even last year also there was no major flooding in Panjim. That is the first time in I think two decades that it has thing. That in itself is a huge feat. We've opened, we worked with the contractors, contractors gave us labour, we opened up some of the old Portuguese drain. So like that we want to make sure that this year also there are no issues. Looking at the curve. Smart city. Smart city. Smart city. Smart city. For the switch now there is, uh, empty road is left and house connections are left. And MBR has some uh, works to be done in uh, this thing. That Smart City MD will give you an update about that. No, but looking at the current scenario, when you come in the rainy season, you feel that the whatever developments will have been done or will be done, will be the, at the, in the same phase or the same uh, situation? Than last year? Uh, the present one? Yeah, see, last year there was no issue at all. No? There is no reason to think that this year there will be an issue also. That I said, last year was the first year where there was no major flooding throughout the city. See, systematically we've cleared up each and every single uh, flood spot. Usa Circle used to flood, that does not flood anymore. Outside uh, those casino boards, that used to flood, that does not flood anymore. See, slowly, little by little, we've taken up every single... People have very short term memory, but the areas that we've cleared have... I remember reading the papers every single day, every single monsoon, every single day, Panjim used to flood. Last year, there was nothing at all. Aside from the first day, there was no major issue. And Stellimari, Marit Mala didn't flood. Those are big things that was accomplished during this tenure. Because we worked with all the departments, all the departments got together to make sure the work was done. See, like that, we want to make small changes. And since you have made pay parking free, it will be extended or it will be till terminated? See, that we want to clarify. I have sent a note to the commissioner. The commissioner will sit to the contractor and work out what the, this thing will be. But as for the next two months, so we don't want any charges to happen. Whether it's an extension or we will decide later as a council once the thing comes to do. Date extends are budget challenges. Date? No, no, no. Smart City work, 31st May, complete that place, it's not the project. Yeah, that is what is said, 31st March. Till then. You spoke... Your complete is another date extended. But that I know, that we'll see. You spoke about national data. This time, there will be no flooding. Yeah. You're planning for it. Yeah, but last year also there was no flooding. So, here the minimum federal level, there was no last year. You have to say that the roads are in place. See, last time also during that G20, we had told the PW to open up all those roads. Those drains also had not been opened up for the past 15-20 years also. That is because all of that...